Hey everyone, how's it going? Jamie Wagner here again. Hey, thanks a lot for watching my video here, and thank you to everyone who has subscribed to my channel and all the likes and all the comments. I really appreciate that, and I'll keep doing some videos. So again, I have my Google Nexus 7 second generation tablet, um, the 2013 model from Google that I'm playing around with here. I'm not experiencing issues with mine, but I'm just doing the video to um, show you how to reboot to safe mode in case you are experiencing issues with yours, including apps crashing, reboots, uh, fast battery drain, anything that could be caused by third-party apps possibly. Um, this is one method you could try, um, uh, boot in safe mode. And what this does is temporarily disable those third-party apps. So let's go ahead and boot in safe mode and I'll show you how easy this is. Um, all you gotta do is uh, make sure your device is on and, and you're at your home screen there. Find your on and off button, press and hold your on and off button until you get the power off dialog. Now what you wanna do is press and hold this power off. Press and hold that and you'll get the safe mode, uh, reboot to safe mode dialog pop up. And um, there you can read what it says. You know, you wanna boot to safe mode. This is gonna disable all third party apps and they will be restored when you reboot again. So this don't delete, you know, it's not gonna delete nothing it's safe to do. So click okay to get this thing in safe mode. It's pretty cool. Um, putting a tablet in safe mode. I'm used to putting um, computers in safe mode. So that's pretty neat. So we'll wait for it to restart. And what what's pretty cool about this is it actually has a safe mode message that stays on the screen. Basically tells you you're in safe mode so that way you know if you're in safe mode or not. And in order to get out of safe mode, all you need to do is restart the thing. Okay, so there you go. Safe mode. Can't really do nothing with it there, but just log in. Scroll over to your home screen. Now see, you're in safe mode right now. So what I would say at this point is what you want to do is uh, use this device um, use it for a while to see if the problem persists. Um, I would say if it doesn't, you could restart this thing to get out of safe mode and uninstall um, recently installed apps to see if you can pinpoint which one's causing the problem. Um, because <clears throat> right now, if you're in safe mode and you're not having issues with it, then more than likely something's going on in normal mode. So you may have to actually run it in safe mode for a while. Again, I'm just doing this video to, you know, show you how to get in safe mode and get out. Um, in order to get out of safe mode, what you do is press your power button, press your power button again and hold it until you get the uh, power off dialog. Just click power off, click OK. It's as simple as that. It's basically just restarting the tablet. Again, um, if you're in safe mode and you notice you're not having any issues and you may have to use it a while to notice if there's significant battery drain and whatnot, um, then what you want to do is restart, which we're going to do right now. You may have to actually go through this process several times after uninstalling, you know, any third party apps. Um, something you'll have to try if you're having issues with yours. Um, there are other methods. This is just one. I thought it was kind of neat. Go in safe mode and, and play around with it. But um, So let's say in safe mode, you know, you weren't having any issues. And now we're back in normal mode and you are. So you would start by going in your settings. Go to your apps. And any third-party apps like right here, Chase is a third-party app. So what I would do is uninstall that. Click on install, you know back out of that and go back to my home screen, maybe restart the tablet um, and see if I continue to have issues. So that's how you'd want to do it. Um, like if you're still having issues, go in there, uninstall your apps one by one. Um, again, this is just a method to try and how to get in and out of safe mode. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This may not fix your problem. <laughs> um, I apologize if it don't, but it's just something you can go ahead and try. 
it's nice knowing if you go in in safe mode, you know, it's just going to run default stuff and temporarily disable your third party apps. So it just gives you an idea basically that, you know, your third party apps, one of them may, as we download many, may be the issue. So, but it does take some time to do this and you'd probably have to work through them one by one if you want to, unless you just want to uninstall all your apps um, and restart your tablet and see how, how much better it's working. But anyway, that's just a uh, short video here, how to go into safe mode. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks a lot for watching.